Hey guys, my name is Dave, and welcome to another video. Um, unfortunately, I uh, I don't really have much that I'm wanting to talk about today as far as like discussions, rants, or anything really about me. So I've been getting a lot of statements like asking, hey, are you okay? Has, you seem down, depressed, off of the videos that as of this recording were recently uploaded. I do appreciate like all the concern and that kind of stuff, but the thing is, I'm fine. Um, I just have a lot of concerns, and I worry. Oh, I worry more than your average person. I, I'm more peppy or happy than your average person when I am. I'm more angry than your average person. I'm not your average person. I'm kind of the over exaggerated version of that, I guess. I don't know, I guess that's a way to phrase it. There, plus, whenever I do have concerns, I'm always upfront about it. Like, I've had, recently, I actually had a friend of mine who I put myself on Do Not Disturb on my phone for um, the entirety of yesterday, as of this recording, and I think th this person was trying to get a hold of me or something, and because I was on Do Not Disturb, I guess they thought I was ghosting them. I got out of the blue for, like, no reason. Which I don't do unless I absolutely just start hating. Or not hating. Despising the person. When someone starts doing stuff against me to a degree that I can... I'm not going to put up with, that's when I'll ghost someone. I think this person thought that I was, like, an... And not a very lenient person or something. I don't know. That's kind of that bit of that, though. That's like the most recent conflicting thing that's gone on in my life. Just ridiculous crap like that. I actually can't think of anybody who I know and talk to today who I do hit that point with. But I can say this, there are a couple other different things going on right now. They're not particularly concerning me directly, but I actually have a friend who had recently actually been looking, f is still looking for a job, has a job, but is looking for something that will be more beneficial to them. Um, I don't know what the outcome of this is going to be yet, but I actually uh, presented the idea of working for the same company that I do. Um, and this is, I mean, this is someone who's like really close to me too, which I guess to a lot, it's not, to, to those who know me a lot, this isn't going to say very much. Um, but I did want to help. I felt kind of bad for them and wanted to see what I could do. Now, I don't know what the outcome of it is yet. I know that the company I work for has not gotten back to her, but I don't know. I'll just have to see what happens with that one. Now with that bit of the journal entry here, the vlog journal thing, next topic. I think I've actually um, said this before, but I am legitimately planning on moving out of the apartment I'm in into another one. This time though, instead of a shared room like what I'm in now, it's going to be a private. I'll probably still do the same type of setup I have here, except it'll be a bit more organized. The one behind me is kind of scattered brain right now, uh, but it'll be a little bit more organized by that point. It'd be kind of nice to have a private room. This is a thought that's gone through my head a lot. It'd be nice to have a private room again, just cause well, for one, when I fall asleep, it I kind of like listening to music, but the roommate I have, I don't, I've had uh, shared roommates before who are completely against that, and I have to do it in silence, which usually ends up keeping me up all night. Like, the music I listen to, it's kind of the kind of, the, the well-known meditation music, or sounds of nature, I guess you could say, sometimes, too. This kind of stuff is just, like, from what I understand, for most people, just bugs them. It doesn't help at all. So I'm like, all right, I'll respect that, but 
usually keeps me up all night, so I'm like, ugh. Either way around, though, that's actually kind of one of the bigger re It's one of a couple of different reasons why I'm looking forward to um, getting a private room. The other is that I'll be able to spend time with those who I find dear without any kind of need to be out in like a living room or out in the open if not it's not necessary and in future probably like do stuff that you know significant others would do within the time range the year that I'm living in that private room because I've already signed a contract for it and it's supposed to be a year an annual contract starting in May of this year so May 2021 for those who see this so far in the future. Not that at that point it'd be relevant, but... Eh. I don't know. That's pretty much all I have to say. I know this is kind of a mini-journal thing, but I don't have much going on aside from work, well, day job, YouTube, if you want to consider that work. I don't, but I do at the same time. Um, and the stuff that was talked about on here. I don't know. Either way, I am going to leave this video here. Thank you guys for watching this little journal vlog thing that I've done today. Once again, as always, click the links on the side of my head if you want to check videos that are about me in a sense, or discussion rants that I usually do. In the meantime though, I'm going to head off. Thanks again for watching one last time, guys. Um, but I do hope to see you guys in another video. Bye for now.